like said, so because I'm a guy, or what is it like? Like, nobody's asking me that. But I take it all the time. So because I've had two outbursts now, I'm suddenly missed that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, me are free based on how much I love you. And then we had a really good week last week here. And it just felt like coming into this week, I'm kind of stressed. I'm stressed is week nine. Eight of us are up. Three people in the final. I understand it's sticky, but it's like you're all I have in here at least. I'm all you have in here at least. And sometimes I feel like because you know that I never want to test you overreact. I never want to hurt your feelings. I'm not saying you're thinking about this because I've actually just realized that your mouth is just shut. <laughs> Even if you were getting into with Chichi or anybody, I don't want to name names here, and you spoke differently to me, I would feel like there's a level of respect for me that's like, okay, that's my man. There's things that like I just wouldn't say to him, hmm. and these are just my housemates, and I don't love them how I love my man. Do you get what I mean? But when I'm seeing it, I'm like, yeah, me the same way. But you're telling me that you love me. I know you love me, but I have to show you that I love you. I can't just say, yeah, you love me. And I'm not perfect because if I was perfect, I wouldn't say what I said inside. I, I, I argued with people here, I've been my rude. So I'm not even trying to tell you that I'm any better than you or I'm this Mr. Good Guy or Mr. Perfect because I have a lot to learn. I have a lot to, lot to work on. I love myself. But what I said today, yeah, I said it because I want you to know that, and I didn't mean it by the way, but I just want you to know that like, the stuff you say that really pains me, that makes me think so deep, and I've told you this before, I've actually said it big, that big, 